Hi, this is Erin from the Science Off Center team here at the St. Louis Science Center with an experiment that you cannot try at home. This is an experiment from our It's a Blast show, and we did this at Illinois State University at their science shindig. And the reason I'm showing it to you today is because Tom and Will saw the show and requested that uh, we do a video so they could get more detail and uh, learn more about it. What this is, is the electrolysis of water. We're going to split water apart into its components. So pure water, pure H2O, can't really carry electricity. So what we need to do is add some salts in there to get some ions going. So I'm going to take this special salt, which is sodium sulfate. I already added some. I'm going to add a bit more into it. And as I'm stirring this up here, what happens is the salt breaks down into ions, atoms that have a positive or a negative charge. Since they have an electrical charge, they're able to carry electricity, unlike pure water. Next, I'm going to put this airtight cork on here. And the cork has two metal electrodes, you can see. And it has a tube. The tube runs into some soapy water here, and this will be able to catch the the bubbles that are being made. So I'm going to next plug this into a battery charger here. I'm going to plug this up so that we can get some electricity flowing. So now that the electrodes are plugged in, they're essentially electrocuting the water in here. They're sending electricity through and ripping the water apart. Water is, of course, H2O, and so it's ripping it into two hydrogens and one oxygen. So the probe with more, uh, with more bubbles on it, twice as many bubbles, has a hydrogen because H2, there's twice as many of those. Then it's coming into here, and we can see that there's bubbles building up in the soapy water. Now originally this tube just had regular air in it, so some of these bubbles will just be our regular mix of air. But the newer bubbles coming out of here will be hydrogen and oxygen. Hydrogen and oxygen are special because they are explosive. So I think we have enough bubbles here to test and see if these are hydrogen and oxygen bubbles. And to disconnect things here, find out. Yep, hydrogen and oxygen. So come back to scienceoffcenter.org for more science experiments that you can try at home and some that you can't.